the Yankees will look to avoid the sweep in the final game of their three-game series with the Blue Jays up in Buffalo. We'll pick things up in the top of the second. Glaber Torres going to drive one deep left center field, and there's no doubt about this one. A solo home run for Glaber Torres to give the Yankees a 1-0 lead against Tanner Roark and the Blue Jays. So we'll go ahead and take a look at the replay. These highlights I got from MLB.com, so not the full game highlights that you guys are used to. We'll see Glaber Torres touch up on home plate, and the Yankees take a 1-0 lead. We'll now go bottom of the second. Derek Fisher going to drive that fastball from Davey Garcia deep to right center field, and this one is gone. Derek Fisher with a two-run home run deep in the air to right, and the Blue Jays now have a 2-1 lead with two outs in the second. Davey Garcia, his third major league start for the Yankees. We'll see Derek Fisher round in the bases there as the Blue Jays take the lead in the second, but would that lead hold? We'll see. Now we go top of the third, DJ LeMahieu leading off the inning, first pitch, lines it in the air, deep right field, back on the track, at the wall, and this one is gone. DJ LeMahieu hits one into the seats the other way to tie the game at two. Here in the top of the third, his fifth home run of the year to tie this game up. We're going to go ahead and take a look at the replay. This is a fastball. He didn't miss it. Up and away, he goes with it, lines it in the air, deep right field, take a look from behind home plate, and he puts that one Right over the wall and right, you see the cardboard cutouts. They're excited. Take a look at the side view of the swing. Great swing by DJ. It's now top of the fifth. Runner on second, one out. Voigt going to line one back up the middle for a base hit. Wade was on second, so he'll round third and score. So Luke Voigt picking up the RBI single, and the Yankees take a 3-2 lead in the fifth. Trying to avoid the sweep. Trying to avoid going down four games behind the Blue Jays. We'll take another look at that swing by Voigt. Just lining it right back where it came from. Good approach at the plate. You'll see Tyler Wade rounding third. He's got plenty of wheels. He'll score easily on the play. 3-2 Yankees. Now Glaber Torres later in the inning. Going to line one down the left field line for a base hit. Two runs are going to score here. Voigt coming around from second. Hicks going to come around from first on the two-run double by Glaber Torres. And the Yankees all of a sudden now have a 5-2 lead. Now we're going to take a look. Davey Garcia in the start. He's going to get Davis to strike out swinging on the breaking ball to end the second. Now bottom of the third. 2-2 count, and Randall Gritchick going to strike out swinging for the first out of the inning. Next batter, Travis Shaw, caught him looking fastball, clipped the outside corner, nice frame from Sanchez, and Guerrero going to strike out swinging as Garcia strikes out the side. Now bottom of the fifth, and he's going to get out of the jam, runner on third, two outs with the strikeout. Now Shaw leading things off in the sixth, he's going to go down swinging, start off the inning, and now bottom of the seventh, Final batter he faced, Davey Garcia, gets the fly out. Seven innings of two-run ball and a game that the Yankees absolutely needed to win. 5-2 to hand things over to the bullpen. We'll now skip ahead. Top of the ninth. Clint Frazier up. Runners on the corners. One out. And the Yankees are going to build on their lead. RBI single in the left for Clint Frazier. DJ comes in to score. And now it's 6-2 Yankees. Three outs away from avoiding the sweep. We're going to go next batter now. Glaber Torres. Runners on second and third. One out. He's going to hit one hard to third. They're going to keep it in the infield. Hicks going to come in and score on the RBI ground out by Torres. And now it's 7-2 Yankees. We're going to go ahead and look at the replay. And nice play just to keep the ball in the infield. If that ball gets down the line, two runs are going to score. So VR is going to throw and get the out at first. But 7-2 Yankees, bottom of the ninth. Aroldis Chapman gets it done. He strikes out the side in the ninth. Yankees win. They beat the Blue Jays 7-2. They avoid the sweep. Now just two games behind the Blue Jays for second place in the AL East. We'll take a look at the full standings. The Yankees currently the 8th seed, a game and a half ahead of the Orioles, and they're going to open up a four-game series with the Orioles in Yankee Stadium starting tonight. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. I want to let you all know, busy times for me right now. That's why I couldn't do the game live. I'm going to be doing as many games as I can, so keep an eye out for that. Thanks for watching, everybody.